Good morning, everybody. Um, the Schakel established the 20th of July in 1976. So only half an hour after Guido Czech in Switzerland started with his organization. A schakel, that's a link in the chain. Why this name? The founders, they said, we, are, uh, we have to have intermediates between us and the outside world. I think almost everybody here in the hall will have had the experience that in a supermarket, and if the man is in the wheelchair and his partner is next to him, and they come to where they have to pay, there are two possibilities. You send your wife or your partner in front, and then everybody is saying, whoa, what a lazy man. And, and he, his wife is more a helper than, than a partner. And if she is staying behind, they are, they are looking, do, you have to pay $20 or, or uh, 15 euro 60 or so. And not speaking to you in the wheelchair. The schakel was mentioned as a link that all, not only the partners, but the fathers, the mothers, the children, the nephews, the cousins, and everything, everybody around would become a member. And so a good relation, and also in a political point of view, a lot more members than only the people in the wheelchair or on crunches. And Guido Czech had this vision also, and he founded an SPV, and I learned that from every four Swiss people, inhabitants, there is one member of this SPV. So there is indeed an enormous strong link between the people with spinal cord injury and the, the world around them. But there is a disadvantage. My brother, one year older, one year and three months older than me, he got a spinal cord injury on the 5th of August at the age of 24. He was a student and I was a student too. He became later on a board member of the Schakel. He had to change his studies. He was studying in the Technical University of Delft and he changed to mathematicals because in a wheelchair it's difficult to roll yourself in an industry between where they are producing cars or uh, uh, other things. And as a mathematician, he started to work during his study already uh, uh, for a couple of months in the summer for operations research of the Royal KLM, the air transport company in the Netherlands. And he did it in such a way that they asked when he had finished his studies to come there and he worked there until he was 61. He could, because he was an employee of KLM, he could travel for free all over the world. Pollution wasn't an item at that time, but he had friends who worked in, in Curaçao in the Caribbean, in Peru, in America, in, in several parts of the world, and he traveled there. And he, his experience was that the travel agencies, the, the transport companies, the airports were not adapted to people in a wheelchair. And he said, we have to do something to that. And he also discovered that the schakel was not a name to be well known in other countries because what does it mean, a link? So he asked me to 
uh, accompany him in a committee to change the statues of the schakel. And so we found it, and still in, in my computer are the statues of Dwarslesi Organisatie Nederland. Querschnitt is that in, in, uh, in German. Uh, and I traveled, of course, with him as a partner, but, but also to have a, a, a word in the committee, how, how are we going to do this? In, I can, in 2004, a little bit too late, but they, they discovered that we are, we did forget to have a 25th anniversary of Dwarselezi Organisatie Netherlands. There was a symposium in the city of Utrecht. And my brother had came with the idea, we are looking where are in other countries uh, similar organizations as our organization. And he, that was far before internet, far before Google and so on. So a lot of faxes, telephone calls, letters, which took two weeks to get an answer. But he discovered there are seven other organizations and they were all organ, uh, invited. From these seven countries, only two were coming. Two representatives, one of Jackie Boulens, last year in Notville, he was present there, a Flemish guy. And the other one was Thomas Troger, from SP Vau in Notville, uh, uh, juridical, uh, yeah, in, in, in law, the doctor in law. And he, to this Thomas, went back to Notville, talked to Daniel Joggi over there, the president of the SP Vau there in Switzerland, and they said, This is a good idea. We invite all our uh, yeah, colleagues, other countries, and he discovered in the year that there are 15. So fif 15, from 15 countries, people were invited to come to Notville and to speak about what will we do. And uh, we, we came, we were impressed about uh, what we saw there in Notville, because the, uh, the, 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 it was the complex of, of buildings was already there, but not, not so large as it is now. But a hospital where in, 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 the, in downstairs in, in, the, in the underground, your car can be adapted to, you, to be used uh, where you are living, and of course, a very good specialist in all kinds of, for instance, I was working in, in, uh, in, in 2000, that time in, in a hospital as well. I changed, like my brother, I changed later on to study uh, uh, medicine, and, and, and I not became uh, 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 an arts. Uh, 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 not a general pract practitioner, but I worked for several years also in, in developing countries where a civil war was going on, and I, I learned a lot about healthcare in the difficulty, difficult on, uh, circumstances, but I was the one to have the best specialist on the best spot with the best equipment in the right time. And, and then you learn a lot about healthcare and how it can be improved or going better. But in Notville, one of the specialists working in the hospital, I was working in, in uh, near Amstelveen, just south of Amsterdam. He was also for a couple of weeks a year working in Notville. And for instance, now in the city where I'm living in, a couple uh, has one son, the son uh, the couple are both general practitioners. The son and his wife 
they worked for all, both for one year in Nottville. So it's always for me good. I'm, I'm not using many physiotherapic help, but to speak to them and to, to be busy with what is going on there. And here I have the names of those. Uh, last year, I, I, uh, to me it was a surprise that hardly only Daniel and, and Francoise and uh, uh, Miriam, they are from the first, uh, yeah, the founding of uh, ESCIF. In 2005 was the, uh, the first uh, meeting. Uh, we spoke about how do we organize it, how do we do it with payments, and I remember that still SPV is sponsoring quite a, quite a bit to the existence of uh, ESCIF. Uh, here you see them. I just spoke to, to Lucy also. Uh, for, for <laughs> you see Colm Bully, the, the Irish guy, but you see here from, from Dougie Johnstone and Adrian O'Connell from Scot Scotland. Uh, they were all, all present there, and t when I see this, and the la with my brother, I, of course, often was his companion to go to, not only to Notril, but I'll show them. I collect, one of them goes to the, these, this I collected in Umach when it was in Croatia. This is from the SPV in Notril. <laughs> This is a disc all about the organization in Scotland. Then I have, these are the, the minutes of the Congress coming together about our talks in, in Notville in 2005. And so I can go on, but for instance, from Gabi, the, the, the wheelchair, uh, being in a wheelchair, the general practitioner in Innsbruck, I got this. S 60 years in a wheelchair. That's what, what my brother did. He, he died uh, three years ago, just before his, uh, a couple of weeks before his birthday. And uh, it's uh, at the age of 81. His death had no, nothing to do with uh, wheel, being a wheelchair, no bladder problems or uh, decubitus or things like that. But it was a, a, a very aggressive cancer in the lymph system. And so within two months, gone. Uh, but so I, I've met, this, for instance, a thesis. I've, I have a double. So Last year I asked already, in, uh, is it in the library in, in Notville? And if not, you can have it, but it's still here. So if <laughs> Albert doesn't raise his hand or Danny, they can uh, take it with them and other, probably there is somebody else who wants to have it because it's my intention to, to that it is the, the last time I'm in such a meeting like this. I, I, I went already with my wife uh, last year for, for the last time, and then this was a subject, so please come, come another time. So you can approach me if you want to have such a thesis. Uh, here I have the, 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 and probably there is one mistake. Uh, that in 2009, it was not here, it was in, in Vienna, wasn't it? And, uh, but what good to see here, that we have never been in, 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 in the Brexit countries. Uh, we, have, we have only once been three years ago in, in Göteborg, and there is a strong uh, inter-country uh, uh, conference every year going on. Denmark, Norway, Sweden, and Finland, I thought also. And, and only once in, in Scandinavia. And you see that Notville with four times is ahead of, the, of, of our competition. 
And uh, I thought that S Slovenia was number two in, with three, but that, that must be twice, I think. And then also the Rijp uh, in the Netherlands. Uh, and and uh, is uh, for two times and so, and uh, the day before last year, so 2020, there was no uh, conference. Uh, I hope that this will be also be a stimulation for the country who haven't hosted uh, a conference to, to apply to Albert. Can we organize it with a good program <laughs> and, uh, and a good ac accommodation? Well, I wrote this before I, I, ha I had a list of participants of this conference. And I've, I, I'm asked to, to talk about the history, but the history is only helpful to know a bit, to be better prepared for the, for the future. And so I looked to the future and I say, why not a quarterly digital newsletter? If we are going tomorrow home, then we don't hear about each other. The aim of my brother was mutual contact on a private basis, but also from organization to organization. You saw when the, the first people were there uh, in 2006, there were four, four people from Lithuania. Where are they? Where were they last year and the year before? Via LinkedIn, I still with Thomas Ludovicius and, and one other, I have contacts. I have their cards still and the telephone numbers also does do work. But why aren't they here? Why aren't, haven't we got now uh, one large letter, one sending to Stefan, our president, for uh, wishing good health, and why not a letter, well, we miss you from Lithuania or from Norway, never been here. That, that's my suggestion. And I, now, I think the rest is clear. Uh, I wrote that now, I, of course, I knew that, that uh, uh, Nuti would be for coming from Scandinavia, but I was surprised to see that also from Sweden uh, uh, there is one. But from the French speaking, Jackie Boulens, he is of course fluent in, in French, he visited the organization in France, and I hope that there will be uh, 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 there's no, uh, for instance, no, I tried it. I have several friends I had, they were working in Luxembourg to, to establish or to, to look, is there an organization? There must, there should be 600, according to 600 people in a wheelchair in Luxembourg, but no organization. And why not? In the, in the Welsh, so, so the, 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 the French speaking part of Belgium, no organization, Nobody seen in, in the scene of ESCIF. So I think there's a lot to do. Uh, now, and I mentioned here also the, the, the Balkanians, <laughs> I call them. But uh, the, 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 I was glad to see they're from Serbia and, and so there are, but and Albania, there are people now present. So don't blame me that I, I, I wrote this, but it was in, in my enthusiasm. Now, if there are any questions, uh, feel free, if I have still time. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay, yeah. Now, I, I hope you, for mutual contacts on the private level and on the level of organizations, I hope there will be improvements. At least this conference and also last year, it was all, all already, in, to my opinion, better because uh, if the group is not too big, let's say there are 27 uh, countries in, in, in Europe and every 
uh, association is coming with two representatives, then with 50 in four days you can do a lot. I wish you all good health and good luck. <laughs>